It's very dark. Good morning, friends. Welcome. You might remember my friend Rob. Hey. It is a miracle that Rob is awake at this hour. <laughs> Damn straight. <laughs> Doesn't happen often. But it's a special day because we are parked in a parking lot waiting for the sunrise at, what's the name of this place? Circle B Bar Reserve in Lakeland. Welcome. The trail actually goes in there, but this, this goes to it. So you can go past the nature center. Discovery Center. I can't see the boardwalk we're on in front of us, so I hope we don't walk off. Yeah. <laughs> I, we need a lighting crew. Yeah. So the mosquitoes out here are, are crazy. We have come to their territory and they're eating us alive right now, so we gotta keep moving. But we're on our way to a trail that should have some, some cool wildlife out and about. You saw some critters out here last time you were here. Oh right? yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, spiders, man. Spiders. Brought my spider stick. <laughs> We're the first ones on the trail. So there's spiders everywhere. Spiders out and about, too. Lots of critters out here. I'm excited to see what else oh, yeah. is hanging out here. Rob was just telling me that the pigs do this to the sides of the walkway. Just tear it all up. Why do you suppose they do that, Rob? I don't really know. I was watching another video, and the pigs, this is a family of pigs that live out here. And I've seen them last time I was here. And apparently they just root up the ground everywhere, just looking for food or whatever huh. they're doing. Well, you gotta do what you gotta do. But, uh, you can see where they chew it up along the side of the trail all throughout it's here. It's all over. We need more light. Rob is motivated by photography. He is out here with his very nice camera. Get some good shots. It's going to be the perfect light out here. It is. It's like really like turning on. I've never been out here before and didn't really know what to expect. It's like marshy. Uh, a lot of, a bit of everything. A lot of everything, yeah. There's a lot of Florida, natural Florida looking stuff out here. Going into a little bit more old growth forest right now. Yeah. The goat trees, Spanish moss. Beautiful out here. The Circle B Bar Reserve used to be a family-owned ranch. It was sold to the state in 2007, I believe, for about seven and a half million dollars. Now it's been preserved out here for anybody to come check it out from 5.30 in the morning until 8 p.m. every day. They ask you not to go off the trails because the wildlife is real out here. You can hear the alligators. Have you ever heard that? We'll, we'll try to get some sound of it, but it's, they're, they're close. And I'm sure in this marshy swamp area, there's all kinds of critters hanging around. Looks like a giant snake bed to me. <laughs> Correction, it's been owned by the state since the year 2000. We have a family of sleeping construction equipment. Most of Alligator Alley is closed, but you can walk up to this observation area and hopefully we get a glimpse of some gators.
we just saw a bald eagle. That was there's two bald eagles flying around right here. How cool is that? You don't see those very often around here. You hear about them. I've seen one or two in my day, but that was cool. Welcome to Lake Hancock. It's a very large lake. I had no idea that this all existed here. It's a beautiful part of Florida. The weather right now is just about perfect. I'm able to wear these long sleeves and long pants here because it's about I don't know, 74 degrees, 75 degrees. The wind is blowing just lightly and colors in the sky are perfect. It's a great day. The woodpecker. Bald eagle wingspan, up to 90 inches. Better than me. Those pigs do some damage. Bat house. mischievous looking gator there. It's a huge tree that's been fallen down. Looks like it's been down for a while since they built a bridge around it. Wow, oh, it's still alive. Looks like it's pretty healthy too. They're closed, Rob. I said we break in. Play with the stuff. That would be illegal. Okay, you're right. We're not going to do that. But we are going to keep our journey going this morning. Yeah, for sure. Nature. The map is pretty cool. It tells you about all these flowers and animals that you might see on the trail. That's the bald eagle. We saw a herd, some other of these creatures in the distance. Last time Rob was here, he saw a bobcat. Harmless. On the other side, there's the map to the park. So we're in the, this vicinity here, and we just walked all the way over here to this observation area. We're parked somewhere along the path. Friends, a circle B bar reserve is really cool. A little disappointed that we didn't see any of the big gators walking in front of us, but we saw gators. We saw probably, how many gators did we see out there? Probably about nine or 10 at least that we saw on that yeah, short hike. Nine or 10, so nothing to be disappointed about, but there were some other cool critters of the forest. Saw the bald eagle and uh, some woodpeckers. Yeah. Heard some three on one tree. Heard some things in the distance. Couldn't really tell what it was. Could be a gator, could be a bullfrog. Had some weird noises. And glad we got out here early too. It's a nice time of day. No, it's perfect. Yeah, perfect. Lots of, it's beautiful out, it's cool. Yeah. The weather's really starting nice. Starting to get hot. Yeah, starting to. Well, it's time to change out of these 
long pants and long shirt and probably get some breakfast. Ooh, there's a place nearby here, Fred's Market. Fred's Market, never heard of it. It's a bunch of, it's legit home cooking buffet style. Okay, well, believe it when I see it. Let's go. All right, let's do it. So lots of birds out here too. The elusive 12 megapixel blue jay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we did, we found the 12, <laughs> The 12 megapixel blue jay up here. It's uh, not in fact a birdhouse. It's a security camera <laughs> disguised as a birdhouse. Hey pigs, what are you doing? What are you looking for? Why are you doing this? She just made to do it. Oh, where'd that sticker come from? Ah. Rob, I like these stickers you got on the back of your car. There's some good ones. Yeah, there's a couple good ones there. This is a buffet. Pretty price, ten ninety nine. Dude, I did not know this was a buffet. This is awesome. This is all the bacon, <laughs> all the country goodness. Country time buffet. It's, it's the real old ladies back there cooking home cooking. You have to wash your hands and then wear gloves before you approach the buffet. There's some real good looking stuff on that buffet. I got a lot of stuff. I got probably more than I can eat, but there's more up there that I couldn't fit on the plate. I've got to try. Fried green tomatoes, corned beef hash, really good gravy. This is awesome. I am Fredhead now. I feel like I've been converted. That breakfast was killer. Thank you for telling me about it. Wow. about food yeah. Oh, Rob, thanks for telling me about the Circle B Bar Reserve. Circle B Bar Reserve. And for, yeah. for telling me about Fred's. Taking us all there. That was very kind. Yeah. Did you get some good shots today? I think I got a few good shots. Cool. Go we'll, we'll through them a little bit later. Are you full? I am very, very full. <laughs> Recommend this place. Oh, man. 100%. Do you have anything in your favorite on the, on the uh, buffet? Oh, uh, the corned beef hash was killer. Uh, the corned beef hash was good. I like the fried green tomatoes, and they had this casserole mix-up stuff. It's a little spicy. It was good. Well, friends, thanks for joining us today. I appreciate it. If you like what you're seeing, hit the buttons. We'll see you in the next video, or I'll see you the next video. He, you might see him Maybe. in the next video. Who knows? I could be back. You never know. See you, friends. We've got to keep moving, actually. No. <laughs> the mosquitoes are... Yeah. Mosquitoes wake up early, are apparently. Up and ready. We're in their home. We're visiting their, their territory, so things are... I don't know what I'm saying right now.